Mario once again, Sunday, October 12, 2025, and this is yet another video with uh, respect to uh, RC helicopters. This uh, little guy right here is a C-129 version 2. I'm not going to do a review. I am just using this as a point of reference. Uh, there are so many videos uh, that have uh, come out and um, done uh, uh, or, show, or show reviews of this particular pro product. If you want to see how this performs, go check out those videos. Uh, you can search uh, by the name and you'll come across uh, these, these, um, these uh, videos on this helicopter performance and all that. Uh, what I am going to uh, say in this video is that I uh, I bought this helicopter because I, I I like the I like the shape. You know, this is one of those helicopters that uh, caught my eye by nature of its uh, shape. And let me just turn this around and give you an idea of what that looks like. Look look how look how cool that canopy is. Um, other than that, it's just your basic uh, uh, basic. Uh, uh, I believe these are 10, 11 inch. Uh, rotor helicopters that um, that are uh, very uh, popular uh, in uh, these days or I, I think this probably came out a, a year ago maybe a couple of years ago from the same company RC era that is has manufacturing all those other scale helicopters uh, the same transmitter is uh, used so it's um, basically the same uh, they, they all uh, employ the same stabilizing uh, circuitry uh, so having said that, I like the I like the looks of the, uh, the helicopter, the simplicity of this uh, helicopter. Uh, it this it, it does have a, it, it's not collective pitch, but it does have camber blades. But all the stabilization is done but via the uh, the circuitry. The only thing that I uh, have um, that I don't like, you know, this um, and, and this is my personal uh, opinion and my personal taste is that this is way too stable for my uh, my my hands. My hands are trained, you know, I, I learned the hard way to fly helicopters, and so my hands are trained to do all the stabilization via the the, the sticks. But this, when I fly these things, and uh, the same thing with the scale one that I showed uh, the Bell 206 in another video, uh, they are so stable that it just takes for me it takes the final way of you know uh, uh, that challenging um, uh, feature of having to control the, the helicopter yourself and so that's why i i have a, i have an issue with it because it's way overstable and it just wants to defeat that you know so i'm trying to i'm trying to make it go one way and it and it wants to stabilize and and stay in one place so i i don't like that of these uh, all six uh, uh, axis uh, stabilizers i rather have the old fashion ones you know like the ones that i was making you know like the bumblebee and some of the older ones like the blade uh, 120s uh, 